All right, what's up guys? Grizzly Kicks here coming back to you guys today with an all new video and today I'm pretty sure you guys know what I picked up. It's the most recent release. Um, I don't even know when this video is going to drop, so I'm not going to say recent release, but one of the most, oh, honestly, I didn't think it was the most hyped up release of this year so far. I mean, it's the most valuable. I didn't think I was going to pick these up, honestly. Uh, I didn't have the intentions of actually really trying. Like, obviously, I really tried to pick them up from online, but if I didn't get them, I really didn't care because I only wanted them for one reason was to resell because I know these were gonna go for some some good money and I already sold them so the sad part is that oh, these are not gonna even they're not gonna even be able to go up on my shelf because I'm selling them tonight and the reason I'm um, wearing this outfit I don't know if I explained to you guys already I have like short-term memory loss when making videos apparently I just came from my baseball game I need to get it over with this video like dumb quick so Oh, I need to get over with it dumb quick because I'm selling these tonight. So yeah, let's just go ahead and start cutting them open. Uh, shout out to the Bergenfield Bears real quick, yo. And yeah, so let's go ahead, get these out. Couldn't wait, like, ugh, don't wanna talk anymore. I don't know why I'm opening it like this. So stupid, opened it upside down too, and I got the receipt right here. I got them straight, straight from Nike. And I picked these shoes up 20 minutes after the release date. I couldn't believe it. Like, my mind was blown. They were up there 20 minutes later. And as soon as you guys see the box, you're gonna know what it is already. So let's get it out. Oh no, why did I open them upside down? Hold on, all right, all right. You guys know what it is already. Already know what it is. Let's just. Alright, yeah. Alright, so. Got the box open. Now, you know, I gotta do my quick little Snapchat of picking up these shoes because I don't mind my hair. I, uh, yeah, guys, I cut my hair off, by the way. I had to cut it for baseball. It was bugging out in the hat. Couldn't deal with it. Uh, I'm growing it back like it looks crazy right now because of the hat. It looks dumb flat, but yeah Let's get this snap real quick. Hold up. Yo, say what's up to the snap guys snap say what's up to YouTube Got a new pickup and here just so you guys can add me on snap and understand why Snap gets to see it first Snap gets to see it first Ooh, Oh my god God, this is why you should have me on Snapchat. You guys get to see it first. All right, yeah, that's it. So let's rewind so we can get it all over with. You guys are not gonna have my like actual reaction because Snap saw my actual reaction. Yeah, might seem a little sad, but add me on Snap. It's the big T, one, two, three, four, five. Yes, I made that Snap when I was like eight. Don't ask me if I could change it and I have to make all new Snap. And I already tried everything in my power to change the name. It's not happening. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and show you guys these shoes. Oh, God. Oh, I just can't wait to... Mm, just can't wait to touch them. I've Honestly, I've never held these pair of shoes before. Like, I've never held this colorway. I've never held this, like... I just never held this shoe specifically. This Jordan. So... Oof. Oh my god, oh my god, oh. Bro, I, I can't right now, yo. The smell is so strong, I could smell it from up here. And I have a cold. Yo, that's a really strong smell. I have, I'm sick and I still smell it from all the way back here. Oh, here we go, guys. As you can see, we picked up a pair of the Royal Ones, 2017 Royal Ones. I'm gonna get a close up for you guys. That's what you guys. That's what you guys are gonna see right now as I review the shoe very quickly. So, oh my God, I uh, yo, I words can't describe how beautiful this shoe is, and I'm so sad that I have to get rid of it. Like, I really wanted to rock these, but. 
Oh, I just can't. I gotta sell them so I can get more money to make more videos for you guys. And uh, yeah, that's how it works in life. And you know what? I'm not sorry about selling them. I am, but you know, I know one day for a fact I'm going to see these shoes again. Not just one pair in my collection, multiple pairs. Multiple pairs. So, yeah, let's get right into the quick review. Because I'm not going to go too much in detail because, like, you know, all these YouTubers now, Sneaker in the Bay, Bullet RC, Tony D2 Wild, they all, you know, they're like, they got connections with Jordan now, and that's like the highest connections in the sneaker game, getting like a connection with the company itself. And, you know, they get these shoes sent to them and stuff, and they get to see it before. And, you know, they're touching bread, they're touching the back, they can get it whenever they want. And,. I know one day I'm gonna, I'm gonna be there too. I just gotta keep grinding and I'm gonna get there. But yeah, let's get into the shoe. So as you guys can see, we got a nice black and blue colorway, one of the classic colorways in just, you know, in the sneaker game, like the Air Jordan Royal Ones. Like, you can't go wrong with these. These are so beautiful. They did a nice tumbled leather on the toe box and the Nike swoosh. It just, they, they nailed it. and. I think the tumble leather is good. I do. I wouldn't like if, like, you know, it was just all smooth. Like, it adds perf It just perfects it, and the feeling of the leather is just great. They did good, I think, in the quality wise. Like, quality wise, I think they did good. I personally do not like when they put the suede check on it. I, I don't. I just don't. The suede slash nubuck. I think leather looks good because the nubuck it gets like dark and, you know, you're gonna have to clean it like a lot and sometimes like you just mess it up it can't be fixed then uh, I have had customers come to me to redye their check and you know it never really turns out 100% fixed and that's why I don't like it it just looks better with leather too in my opinion but yeah got the nice cocaine midsole and you guys saw those satin ones that came out like I thought those were, I thought that was like an April Fool's joke. I still do. I, I'm so confused because Retro picked up a pair on his channel, and after that, then I like I started rethinking like, is it a joke or not? I thought I didn't know it was real. I thought it was just a joke. I still don't know, honestly. Uh, but yeah, let's not digress. Those satin ones, the blue on the bottom was different. That's the only thing that was different from this pair. And the, the insole inside and the padding inside, way different and more comfortable, which I can never understand why can't why they just can't do it on this pair. I mean, we can see they're capable of making other shoes very higher, like, you know, higher in quality, like why can't they do it with these? And ones, they're one of the most uncomfortable retro to wear in my opinion. Reason being is because my feet are wide, like I'm a big dude. My feet, you know, when I step, spreads and like, you know, it just, she was just very narrow. So every time I pick them up, I have to get something like an 11 or 11 and a half. Uh, my Kentucky ones that I have, I had them in a size 11 and a half and I couldn't fit 10 and a half. I was so surprised. But yeah, so these shoes are a little rough for me, but I still rock them. Like they're beautiful. Don't get me wrong. Uh... I'm just so sad that I have to let them go tonight. Like, I can't even hold on to them for a day. They're gonna be gone tonight. But yeah, let's finish this review really quickly because I gotta go get the shoes to him. Get the nice blue bottom, classic bottom on the Jordan 1s with a nice Nike logo in the middle. The blue, I like the blue on this, this pair. It was perfect in my opinion. Um, not too dark, not too light. This probably would be my favorite like release of these. Um, I know they've they've retroed like three or four times now, but they're great. They're great. Uh, these are perfected. The blue is good. The leather is great. Tumbled leather. Mmm. Perfect. 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 Just gonna wrap it up for this video. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please go follow me on Instagram. My Instagram is grizzly.kicks. Go follow me on Twitter. My Twitter is grizzlykicks. And also, if you want to see behind the scenes and a lot more in my life, and I have a lot, like, you know, I'm trying to reach 10K 
views on snap so go add me on snap you're gonna see a lot of behind the scenes I'm trying to reach 10k views on snap uh, you're gonna see a lot of behind the scenes stuff there stuff you won't see on my channel most of the time so you know go at me on snap if you want to see all of that uh, help me get to 10k views I'm almost there actually yeah that's gonna end it for this video I hope you guys enjoyed um, yeah, this is Grizzly Kick signing off. I'll see you guys next Monday. Want to sign off with me? Just say peace. Peace.